What's up guys? So breakfast is in and I've got this crazy little bun on the top of my head. So that means it is time for the gym. Before I get into today's vlog, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you may have seen that I have opened enrollment for my holiday training camp. For those of you who don't know, I run eight week online training camps every season. This year, I decided to open one up around the holiday season. Now that might sound a little bit crazy, but I know a lot of people stress around the holidays. We stress about the added temptations, the holiday parties, going out and falling off track of our diets. That's essentially why I wanted to open up a holiday training camp so that I can provide you guys strategies for staying on track during the holiday season and strategies for incorporating those holiday treats without feeling any guilt. With my eight week holiday training program, I provide you with a nutrition guideline, two hardcore training plans, and the best part about it is that all of my campers also get access to a private Facebook group with myself and all of the other campers and it helps so much with accountability, with motivation, and we encourage each other, especially through the holiday season where it tends to be a little bit more difficult to stay on track. But I can give you all the right tools and strategies for making it through the holiday season successfully without any stress and without any guilt. I cannot stress that enough. I wanted to let you guys hear it right away because if that is something you are interested in, please reach out to me so that you can reserve your spot. All you have to do is send me an email. It's going to be the first line in the description description box below and all you have to say is that you want more information about my holiday training camp and I will get back to you with all of the details so that you can reserve your spot. I absolutely love interacting with you guys here on YouTube and in the comments and this will just be another level and caliber for us to interact with one another. So I'm really excited to spend eight weeks with hopefully many of you who decide to sign up. Camp will begin on November 21st. Reach out to me ASAP you get done watching this video. As always, I appreciate you guys being here. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, and I will catch you guys in the next clip. Ooh. What's up guys? So I made it through two full days of juicing. Because you guys only saw juices one through three in my previous vlog, I wanted to give you a little look at juices four, five, and six in this vlog. They were all absolutely delicious. I highly, highly encourage you guys to check out juicemegourmet.com if juicing is something that you're curious about, maybe just want some more information about, or if you're interested in juicing for yourself. Definitely check it out. The juices were so good. My digestion honestly feels a world of difference. I'm definitely a believer. It definitely helped. It is day three and instead of juicing, I decided that I'm feeling well enough as far as digestion goes, which was my main purpose for juicing, to get back on my regular diet. So I'm back to whole foods today. I will probably still incorporate the six juices that I have left over throughout the day and actually track them because the macros are listed on the back of the bottle. The beet juice is one that would be an amazing pre-workout. Juice number six, which is the boost of healthy fats, is a great juice to have either pre-workout as well or before bed. Juice number one with the lemon and the cayenne is an awesome juice to have first thing in the morning. All of the juices, they serve a great different purpose, so I definitely will still get my use out of the six juices that I have left over. I'm back on my regular diet today. My digestion feels amazing. My stomach from the inside just feels healthy. I have a busy day today and then I'm going to be meeting up with a friend to train at Gold's who is in town. So I'm very excited about that. We're going to hit back. I took two days off from weight training because my body was feeling a little run down and I am ready and excited to hit the weights today. So I had a hair appointment this morning out in West Hollywood and I just finished up and I decided to take myself out to lunch. Found this cute little spot called the Cabbage Patch and I ordered a salad. It's just romaine lettuce, shredded cabbage, I added grilled chicken breast, and I got it without the cheese. So something like this, even though it may not be in my fitness pal because it is a smaller restaurant, um, lots of the chains you can usually find nutrition information in my fitness pal, but something like this is very easy to estimate. You could do a large bed of lettuce, add in some cabbage, so I would just account for the veggies and the chicken. Looks like it's about three to three and a half ounces, and that's essentially all that's on here. Clearly, I didn't like that salad one bit. <laughs> I am at the Cabbage Patch in Beverly Hills, so if you guys are out here, check this place out. It was really good. What's up, guys? Welcome to the Cabbage Patch. 
What's up guys? Just got to gold finally after my super romantic lunch date in Beverly Hills. Party of one. Just picked up Josh. Say what's up, Josh. Love you too. Josh is in town and we are about to hit back. This is my first workout in two days because I haven't been feeling well, so I am so excited. Stay tuned for what we are going to do after this workout. I will only give you guys one little hint. It will be Josh's first time. Say you love me, say you love me, but you never left for me. Yeah. Ooh, all we do is make out. I apologize for the quality of this workout footage. It appears that something was a little bit messed up with the ISO in my camera while we were filming, but I tried to mess with it a little bit, and I hope that you guys still enjoy the footage. As always, the entire workout will be listed in the description box below. Josh is a great friend of mine and he also has some really good inspirational content on his YouTube channel and on his Instagram as well. So I will link all of his social media channels in my description box below. Make sure that you follow him and say what's up. Hey girl, cause I'ma be alright tonight. I'm lost without you, I can't help myself. How does it feel to know that I and I only met this girl on Monday Took her for a train on Tuesday We were making love by Wednesday And on Thursday and Friday and Saturday And chilled on Sunday But if you're home there, let's do it Ride it, my pony, yo I don't know your name, but it's Cuban been missing uh, I wanna take you down, I really wanna take you down Cause you remind me of a girl that I once knew We are at my absolute favorite place on the Venice Boardwalk, the Pokey Shack For a little post-workout grub And this is Josh's first time having Pokey So excited! It is a wild night here on the Venice Boardwalk Sunset is absolutely freaking beautiful. Look at this beautiful Poke Bowl. What do you think, Josh? This is amazing. So Plus, good. You're gonna know me by name here. Mine is an ahi base, and then I did a mixture of seaweed and kale. Those things that look like flowers are actually watermelon radish, and then there's some grilled pineapple, a bunch of different vegetables, and some kimchi as well. Time to eat. What's up, guys? See, this is the struggle with bangs when it's windy out. It's just not really cute, but it is a beautiful weekend here in Southern Cali. Felt so good to get back into the gym after two days off of not really feeling well, but I was able to hit it 10 times harder because my body was fully recovered and rested. So remember to take your recovery seriously, guys. It's just as, if not more important than the actual training itself. Listen to your body and don't be afraid to take one or two days off when you really need it. Your body will thank you and when you get back in the gym, you will be a million times stronger because you are fully recovered. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I've been posting a lot about the bodybuilding.com spokesmodel search that is going on right now. I've been posting a lot encouraging people to do it and go for it. I entered back in 2014, made it to the finals, ended up getting runner up, and shortly after got sponsored by bodybuilding.com and I've been working with bodybuilding.com ever since. It was truly such an incredible experience for me. I've gotten lots of direct messages and emails from people after I've been posting saying things like, I don't know if my body is ready or I don't have a fancy camera to do any kind of special video or special edits. And listen, guys, when I entered in 2014, I didn't have a camera like I have now that I use to vlog. I knew nothing about editing videos and I'm still learning about editing videos. If you go back to the first video on my channel, you'll actually be able to watch my entry back in 2014 where I literally just sat at my kitchen table with my iPhone and I just told my story. You don't need all of the most fanciest or best things. There's never going to be a perfect time to do anything. You're never going to have the perfect amount of resources 
or the perfect circumstances. Those things don't matter. It's about passion and it's about doing something that you love and telling a story that is true to your heart. And that is what's inspirational. There's never going to be a perfect time. There's never going to be the perfect circumstances. If you want something, you gotta go for it now. If you keep waiting for the perfect time and the perfect opportunity, you're going to end up waiting for the rest of your life. If I would've said no every single time an opportunity arised and I maybe didn't feel ready or fully prepared for it, I would've missed out on some of the best experiences of my life. I want everyone to be able to experience life on the other side of fear and experience how much freedom there is when you let that fear go and how much happiness there is when you let that fear go. So you guys, if there is something that you want and something that you're passionate about, don't let fear stop you. Don't let outside circumstances stop you. Don't wait until you're ready. Just go for it and you very well may surprise yourself. I so appreciate you guys being here for listening to all of my rants, for watching all of my videos, and for interacting with me in the comments section please if you watch this video leave me a comment say hi let me know what you think it means the world to me that you're here and I thank you guys so much for watching please remember to give this video a thumbs up on your way out please subscribe to my channel if you have not already and I hope to see you guys next time